All right, let's see what happens here. Has the target arrived at school? We look so creepy just standing there in the corner, peering from beside. Hello, <laughs> looking for Kanji here. His name is Kanji, right? I have no idea. Yes, ma'am. Visual ID confirmed. <laughs> what if he spies or something? Target arrived in zone near the end of his mess break, with mother issued rations in hand. <laughs> So oh, these guys are great. Current status in the bathroom fixing his hair. The target was acting nervous. I left my position before he had a chance to pick on me. I wonder what kind of plans they made. It didn't seem like he knew that boy very well. Mm hmm. Well, I think there's something more subtle. Oh, he's here. Oh, there he is. He's totally gonna spot us. He doesn't see us. Surprisingly. I didn't keep you waiting, I hope. No, I, uh, I just got here too. And they're leaving. Probably should follow them there. What in the world was that? Oh, anyways, we gotta hurry after them or we'll lose them. Okay. Then let's split up into two groups. One team will follow Kanji, and the other will stake out the shop. I'll go with uh, Yukiko or Chie. Either one will be good. <laughs> Roger that. How should we split the teams? Hmm. I think we should pair with Yukiko because we haven't really got to hang out with her much. Pairing with her might be pretty good. You know what? Yeah, let's do that. We got good relationship with Chie, in good relationship with Yosuke. When do you start something with Yukiko? I'm gonna pair with Yukiko. Fine with me. Okay. Oh man, they're almost out of sight. Come on, Yosuke. So I'm pairing up with Chie? Okay. Alright. We'll need to pretend we're on a date to make it look natural. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yosuke, you smooth, sly talker to you. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute. That means me and Yukiko have to pretend we're on a date. Huh. Yosuke, you're the man, buddy. You the man. I'm down with the plan. <laughs> oh, not in a million years. There'll be no need for that if we stay out of sight. <laughs> I'll, I'll go out with Chie and Yukiko both. Sure. Not at the same time, though. Not at the same time. <laughs> oh, Let's hurry up and go. All right, then. <laughs> that was pretty funny, though. I wonder if those two will be alright. Ah, they'll be fine. She's nervous. Oh, um, that leaves us in charge of staking out the textile shop. Mm-hmm. So, shall we? Let's go. Finally, our time to get a little bit closer to Kiko. I'm totally down for that. Let's do it. Oh, hello. Thanks. Sorry about the wait. This one's for you. Thank you. She's so nice. Wow. Everything seems fine at the shop. I hope it stays that way. Same here. Do you think the culprit will come? Hmm. I'm gonna try this. No worries, I'll protect you. It was, I probably, it's probably not something I personally would choose, but the fact that it's there, it feels like the game is challenging me to press this option. And I'm gonna do it. Do you have enough courage? Damn it! Unfortunately, you didn't have enough courage to actually say that. Do you think the culprit will come? We need as much courage as possible. That's why I'm gonna start stacking just courage all the way. Um, I'm sure of it, yeah. I mean, that's why we're staking it out. Then we need to keep our eyes open. Mm-hmm. It would be scary if the culprit did show up. God, it would be perfect to say, don't worry, I'll protect you at this point. <sighs> but if they do, I'll do what I can to help you catch them. Sounds good. You all saved my life. I don't want to be the only one doing nothing. I mean, I'm sure there's something I can do. Yeah. No problem. Oh, sorry. What? I went on and on without realizing. I, I 
guess I'm a little nervous. Why are you nervous? <laughs> Is it because of I've us? I've never chatted with a boy my age like this before. Oh, well, in that case, we're very friendly, and you're more than welcome to give us your number, please. Chie, of course, has no problem getting along with guys because of her personality. Yeah, she's a little more relaxed, yeah. But I think she's had more fun hanging out with you and Yosuke lately. Well, we were trying to save your life. It's not exactly fun, but eh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> the same is true for me. Uh, hello. She getting a little flirty? Oh, she's op She's finally opening up to us. Hell yeah. This is happening. He sends Yukiko's gratitude and affection. <gasps> Ooh. Is this <gasps> done? We did it. Life, what we wanted. Hello, what have we got here? Thou art I, and I am thou. Thou hast, uh, thou hast established a new bond. It brings thee closer to the truth. Thou shalt be blessed with creating personas of the priestess Arcana. Hell yeah! I actually got a perfect priestess we can create with Yukiko. Good. You have established the Yukiko Amari social link of the princess. Arcana. Oh, Priestess Arcana. We gotta hang out with Yukiko more often now. Now, this is a must. You may earn XP bonus when fusing personas of the Priestess Arcana. Hell yeah. Yukiko's determination in battle has been enhanced. Yukiko can now take a mortal blow for you in battle. Aw, that's awesome. Hell yeah. You haven't yet asked Yukiko for contact information. Yes. Yes. Ask her straight out. Yes. Huh? O okay. If you want. You saw that, right? You saw that she blushed. She blushed. We doing good, boys. We doing good, boys and girls. I to say just boys. Boys and girls. We doing good. <laughs> if anybody can offer me any tips on Yuko, that'd be perfect. Please do. Leave in the comments below. Can't always answer since I help out around the inn. But feel free to call any time. This is happening. Hell yeah. You exchange cell phone numbers with Yukiko. There seems to be no change over at the shop. You spoke with Yukiko about many different things. Hell yeah, this is happening. <laughs> we did it! We did it! <laughs> we finally got enough courage to ask her number. <laughs> and she is just running a place. <laughs> Man, this is weird. The position is kind of weird there. Yeah, we definitely stand out. Mm hmm. No, I mean them! I get, I get this weird feeling about them. Weird? What about them's weird? Um, I don't know how to put it. What's up, Chia? Oh, well, maybe it's just my imagination. Hey, how do you think the others are doing? Oh, we do well. Beats me. For all we know, he's hitting on Yukiko as we speak. <clears throat> yes. I'm <coughs> <coughs> sorry, I got a cough. Mm. Yeah, no. He's not like you. Really, no. Yukiko doesn't seem to be interested in that stuff anyway. Eh... Wait, are you saying he's interested in her? Oh, please don't tell her anything. Please don't tell her. Well, hmm... Guess we'll see what happens. Huh? I, I, I wouldn't know. Good, Yosuke, good. We don't really talk about that kind of stuff. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> now I'm even more suspicious. You know something, don't you? Cat's out of the bag. I like them both. I seriously don't know. It's not like we've been hanging out that long. <laughs> totally not. <laughs> Yosuke, you gonna mess this up for me, dude? <laughs> oh god. The hell are you two doing? Well, that's screwed. Oh, well, you see, we're... We're just two crazy lovebirds. <laughs> Yosuke, you... <laughs> I mean, that kind of works out, so hopefully I get some out of the uh, trouble. Uh, what do you mean, bird? <laughs> Play along, bird brain. <laughs> oh my god. Didn't I see you guys yesterday? Oh no. <laughs> Come on. It just so happened that we were walking behind you guys. Pure coincidence. Yeah, totally. Hey, our houses are just over that way, so we'll be going now. Um, look, we weren't planning on getting in your guy's way, and, and there's nothing strange about it either. Oh, Chia. Oh, God, she just messed it up. S strange. Why can't you keep your big mouth shut? Whoa, 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 wait. Damn it! <laughs> well, that's... <laughs> you see what you think? 
<laughs> oh my god! <laughs> done! I'm done! This is the perfect moment! That's it! I think I'm good for today! <laughs> Did I just... Why do you run the park? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm having way too much fun with this game. This is amazing. Oh my god. Hey, are you listening, damn it? <laughs> seriously ain't like that. <laughs> oh, oh, I think what she was hitting out now. I think she was saying that he's a guy, and since the other guy technically looked like a guy, maybe there was something in between them. Hmm. Boys love? I think that's what it's called? I don't know. Well then, that was amazing. Seriously. Great day. Well spent. Lots of laughs were had. We regret to inform that our mission failed. Oh. <laughs> there was nowhere to hide. Well, let's wait here a little longer. Maybe Kanji Kun will come home. Sounds good. Yeah. Maybe Yugiko should talk to him since she knows him pretty decently well. Oh god. Huh? What are you guys doing here? You're those stupid lovebirds I just saw. <laughs> We're not a couple. Hell yeah, Chia. Yosuke, you better say up, Chia. <laughs> what is going on with me? I, th I, I think at this point, I just don't want Yosuke to have either one. <laughs> oh my god, you know what? We're just gonna go on with it for now. <laughs> Why are you assholes following me around? Damn it, what the hell's going on? I ain't saying this is you guys' fault, but damn it! Wow, this guy looks kind of troubled there. Hey, uh, mind if we ask something? Has anything strange happened to you lately? With Yosuke and Chia chasing them down the park and him walking around with another dude, which kind of sounds like a girl, I don't know. Huh? Strange? Mm-hmm. What's this strange stuff, huh? Are you saying that I'm strange? Not even close, actually. Huh? No, 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 I, I didn't mean- Oh, God. You shitheads better get the hell out of my face, or I'm taking you down! Wow, this guy is angry, holy shit. What? Wait, why? I look like I'm joking! No. <laughs> Yo, scared. god damn it. You ran away from Kanji as fast as your legs would carry you. Good. Too much running. Mm -hmm. Well, nothing happened today, so I guess everything's okay. Yeah, I guess. But it's already been a few days since he appeared on the Midnight Channel. Mm -hmm. If this is anything like Yukiko's case, it'll happen soon. Then mm -hmm. we can't let our guard down. I think we should come back tomorrow to check up on him. Sounds good. Looks like we've got no choice. Let's go home. I'm wiped. I'm with you, Chia. I'm with you. Ah, <sighs> well, at least good things did end up happening for the day. No, oh, not a case not saying anything at this point. It's starting raining. I hope you didn't get wet out there. No, I'm good. Maybe it's gonna be up on the midnight channel. Hey, you, hey, Nanako. The boys go pretend they, uh, in games when they run around. Well, good for them, I guess. Um, let's go ahead and check the fridge just in case. Anything nasty in there? Nothing catches your eye. We don't have any lunch as well. Let's go ahead and do this here. Uh, let's save under number three. There we go. Right, let's go check out the Midnight Channel just in case. You feel uh, exhausted from everything that happened today. Rest in your room? Yeah, sounds good. It's been kind of a long day, but it was a very good day as well. I enjoyed it. Especially the part where you go. <laughs> your phone is ringing. Is it Yukiko? By any chance? Oh no! Don't don't be don't don't even trouble don't even worry about it. What's up? Uh, Kanji Kun seems to be missing. Oh. I had some calls to make for the inn, so I called the textile shop as well. Mm -hmm. When I spoke to Kanji Kun's mother, she told me that he left the house and hasn't returned since. She did say that this happens all the time, but what do you think? We should probably check in on that just in case. Should be fine, this sounds bad. Uh, this sounds bad. Yeah, this sounds pretty bad right now. I think so too. He could be... 
Maybe. It's going to rain again tonight. Maybe the Midnight Channel will come on. Maybe. Then we'll know for sure if something happened to Kanjikun or not. Mm hmm. I'll make sure to check out the TV at midnight. Talk to you later. Sounds good. You go hung up. Oh, it's so nice she actually called us. Oh, that's uh, that's awesome. You need to watch them in that channel. Sounds good. Alright, see what we got this time. It's still raining. Something may appear on the TV. Let's see what appears. Hmm. Hello. What is this? You see something on the screen. The image is clear and sharp. Hello. Hello, dear viewers. It's time for Bad Bad Bathhouse. Excuse me? Tonight I'll introduce a superb sight for those searching for sublime love that surpasses the separation of the sexes. <laughs> 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 that right at the very end, oh my god, what do we got, oh god, he looks flushed and everything, he's hot bothering. <laughs> oh my god, okay, let's see what this is. Oh, Jesus. I'm your host, Kanji Tatsumi, serving you this scandalously special sneak in report. <laughs> Alright, Kanji Tatsumi. <laughs> let's see your report here. Goodness. Just imagine the things that might happen to me there. <laughs> well then, let's get this show on the road. Toodaloo. Wow. <laughs> that run. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that was unmistakably kanji. <laughs> Being very fabulous. <laughs> oh my god. <sighs> am I all red? Yes, I am. <laughs> I, I don't know Yosuke, he just- Kanji found his fabulous side. <laughs> Yosuke is still flustered to get his point across. Uh, calm down, buddy, calm down. But that was completely over the top! It certainly was, but at the same time it was the same thing for Yukiko. Though, it really was Kanji. Mm-hmm. Damn it, we guessed right, but he still slipped through our fingers. Oh! I just realized something. Shadow version of Yukiko was a princess that wanted to be rescued from her castle. She was a damsel in distress. Shadow version of Kanji is very fabulous, maybe? That's kind of funny, actually. <laughs> if only we'd held our ground and stayed there a little longer. In any case, that place that was behind him, what do you think it is? Probably some hot spring. A superb sight for those searching for sublime love? I just don't get it. Probably a hot spring. Anyways, we better hurry and come up with a plan tomorrow. Mm-hmm. Go back to the TV world, just grind out levels. You decide to go to bed. <laughs> After seeing that fabulousness. <laughs> oh my god, Kanji. Kanji Tatsumi. So fabulous. <laughs> Given the pattern so far, Kanji's already inside the TV. Yep. I wonder what the Midnight Channel really is. I have no clue. Mm. At first I thought it was one of those paranormal things, but when I gave it a try, it, it was real. Turns out it's actually connected to another world. If there's a rumor going around, that means a bunch of people are watching it. Probably. How did the rumor go? If you stare into a turned off TV on a rainy night, no one in their right mind would try something that ridiculous, don't you think? Unless someone urged them to. Mm -hmm. But if you actually try, it does work. And not just once. Yep. If this rumor spreads and everyone starts watching the Midnight Channel... Are the people that are watching the channel the victims? Or maybe, I guess more people find out that something's going on, so more people will be on, in on it. That's not good, that's gonna cause a huge publicity like, it's gonna be like a huge publicity stunt. It could cause a huge panic. That, that's, exactly, I, I can't speak, Chia, Chia said it for me, whatever Chia said. <laughs> if Teddy is right, the missing people themselves create the stuff we see. So then, Kanji Tatsumi just has a very fabulous side locked deep down inside him. Confirm. So it's not random. 
that's specifically related to whoever goes missing. Yeah. <sighs> Yukiko had a show too, but she doesn't remember doing anything like that. Um, this might be a little off subject, but... Go on. The culprit is probably watching the shows that come on, right? Maybe, otherwise why would these shows come on in the first place? No doubt. He's probably sitting back and enjoying... Wait a sec, I bet he is enjoying it. This is just for someone's amusement then? <gasps> He's probably laughing his head off watching the show that comes on after he throws people into the TV. Probably. Oh, I get it. Yeah, it's definitely possible. Mm -hmm. Ugh. Now when I think of the killer, I get this image of a total sicko. Yeah, it's pretty... Yeah, it's pretty sick, if you think about it. I want to see everything about you, Yuki-chan! I'm down for that. I'm, I don't want to throw in the TV world, but I would like to get to know her a little bit more. <laughs> Wait, so if people saw Yukiko's show, do you think people were watching what happened to me, too? Well, we never saw your show before, so... Oh, that is it! That killer is dead meat! I'm gonna leave footprints all over his face. Jamie's business. <laughs> Guys, first we save Kanji, then we crush the killer. Yeah, let's finally do it. Finally, we crush the killer and send him to hell. Got it? <laughs> so find Kanji, crush the killer, crush him to send him to hell. Sounds good. Y'all you strengthen your resolve to save Kanji. We get better bonded. Oh hell yeah! Oh no, rank. Oh no, we just got full investigation rank up. Good. Okay, sweet. That's good. The investigation team social link has reached level 3. Your power to create personas of the full arcana has grown. Hell yeah. <laughs> What's up? Chie, those last two were the same thing. Oh, she noticed as well. Uh, I know. It has more impact. It definitely was a lot more impact from inspiring. 